A new report documenting racist texts sent by Antioch police officers shows that the texts weren't just directed at suspects, but this time towards their own police chief. Officer Jonathan Adams writes, have you met the new gorilla emoji chief yet? For me, um, again, you know, I don't take that kind of stuff personal. I know who I am. I know what I stand for. And, um, and, and that's enough for me. The comments made towards Chief Ford were uncovered in a new 128-page report from the Contra Costa County District Attorney's Office. Like the previous two reports, the text contained racist language, homophobic slurs, and racist tropes used against Muslims and Jews. And texts like this one demonstrate that officers use racial profiling while out on patrol. Officer Eric Rombo writes, I'm really good at racial profiling. Officer Jonathan Adams responds, I'm a trained expert. Learn from the best in the business. It's essentially the same group of people, you know, still spewing the same hate speech and hate rhetoric. I read enough up until the chief was described as a gorilla, and that was enough for me uh, in terms of um, what I needed to see. Antioch Mayor Lamar Thorpe says he spoke to Chief Ford over the weekend. Thorpe has continuously called for the officers involved, which is up to 40 percent of the entire police department, to be fired. He says the FBI's investigation is all the evidence that is needed. I said to the chief uh, yesterday that all these officers need to be fired immediately. We don't need racists in our police department. Uh, and we need to move on from this. Uh, this is costing the city a lot of money and it's costing uh, taxpayers a lot of money. We want the officers fired and we also want them decertified so they can't just jump to another department. Frank Sterling is an Antioch resident and community activist. He sued the Antioch Police Department for excessive use of force and won. He says more can be done as the investigation continues. We also want the Antioch Police Officers Association disbanded as the president of the Antioch Police Officers Association, Rick Hoffman, is a main uh, factor in these text messages. Last week, Antioch City staff and the police department met with the California Department of Justice, who are also investigating the Antioch Police Department. Chief Ford says a blueprint is being put in place on how to revamp and rebuild the organization. I'm very, very um, bothered by what I'm seeing and, and, and hearing, obviously, but I'm also very encouraged because I know this organization, as we speak, is on the road to recovery. This is not the same organization it was uh, 18 months ago before I got here. In Antioch, Ansar Hassan, ABC 7 News.